Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and today we are continuing the animal series, guys, starting with the cassowary. Cassowaries are flightless birds of the genus Cassarius in the order Cassariforms. They are classified as ratatites, flightless birds without a keel on their sternum bones. Cassowaries are native to the tropical forests of New Guinea, the Aru Islands, the northeastern Australia and northeastern Australia. Three cassowary species are extant. Golden poison frog. The golden frog is found only in the isolated regions of Panama. Its bright color warns predators that it is toxic. Scientists believe that a major cause of its decline is climate change. During drought years, the frogs are forced into overcrowded wet areas, which lead to fatal diseases. The golden poison frog, also known as the golden frog, golden poison arrow frog, golden dart frog, is a species of frog in the Dendrobatidae family. It is endemic to the Pacific coast of Colombia. The optimal habitat of Phyllobates terribilis is rainforest with high rain rates, 5 m. 5 meters or more per year. Altitudes between 100 and 200 meters, temperatures of at least 26 degrees Celsius, and relative humidity of 80 to 90 percent in the wild. Phyllobates terribilis is a social animal living in groups of six individuals. However, captive, fi captive um, phyllobates, uh, phyllobates is often considered terribilis can be, specimens can be in much larger groups. These frogs are often considered innocent due to their small size and bright colors, but wild frogs are lethally toxic and may be the most poisonous of any living animal. Goliath bird eater. The Goliath bird eater belongs to the tarantula family, the Arapacidae. Found in northern South America, it is the largest spider in the world by mass and body length, and second to the giant huntsman spider by leg span. Chimpanzee. The chimpanzee, Pan troglodytes, is uh, also known as a common chimpanzee, robust chimpanzee, or simply chimp. There is a species of gray ape native to the forest of the savannas of tropical Africa. It has four confirmed subspecies and a fifth proposed subspecies. The chimpanzee and the closely related bonobo, sometimes called the pygmy chimpanzee, are classified in the genus Pan. Evidence from fossils and DNA sequencing shows that Pan is a sister taxon to the human lineage and humans' closest living relatives. The chimpanzee is covered in coarse black hair but has a bare face fingers, toes, palms of hands, and soles of the feet. It is larger and more robust than the bonobo, weighing 40 to 60 kilograms, 88 to 132 pounds, for males and 27 to 50 kilograms, 60 to 110 pounds, for females and standing at 100 to 170 centimeters, 3.3 to 5.6 feet. feet. Its gestation period is 8 months. The infant is weaned at about three years old, but usually maintains a close relationship for its mothers for several years, or several years more. Giant Otter The giant otter lives in the rivers of the Amazonian rainforest, and adults may grow nearly 1.5 meters, 5 feet long. It has a powerful aquatic predator, and has a few natural enemies other than anacondas and jaguars. The giant otter has become endangered through increased human activity and is especially threatened by water pollution and hunting for its short, thick fur. G the giant otter is a species from the T Terranura genus. The giant otter ranges across North Central South America. It lives in it lives mostly in and along the Amazon River and in the Pantanal. Menolus of blue morpho butterfly. The Menolus blue morpho butterfly is one of 30 species of butterfly in the sub subfamily Morphinae. Its wingspan is approximately 12 centimeters and its dorsal forewings and hindwings are bright iridescent blue edged with black while the ventral surfaces are brown. 
giraffe weevil. The giraffe weevil is a weevil found in South Africa, India, Southeast Asia. I say this animal here kind of looks a bit different, but I can see why it's called the giraffe weevil. It has a kind of not long neck, though I don't really like uh, like the body forms kind of weird. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Animals, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace!